than 15 seconds later, you see Marky just waited patiently and Fanatiz gets beaten by Mike. Flipside refuses to be defeated, tying it up. And now we are so close to going into our first overtime of the series. 15 seconds. Marky Duda pops this one up. Cookster's already up for it to try and get the angle. He passes over and there's Mike! a shot from Mike. This team play, this is why we love Flipside. Flipside just emotionally abusing shooting goal. <laughs> Cookster with that pass to Mike, and Mike Devo sends it into the corner. Final second, they've got to hold it up, get the full court carry as Adogu plays it off the wall, using that wall as a passer. A lot sends the shot towards the net, it's lofted. Can Dogu get there? He goes for the buzzer beater, and it goes in the tie game. We're going to overtime. I cannot believe Omendog pulled this off, a demonstration of showing that they can definitely, definitely bring it to these teams, keeping it alive all the way from their half to zero seconds hit when it was still in their corner. It was in their corner at one second. And they carry it the whole way. Incredible. Northern Gaming looking for that first goal. Only two minutes remaining in the game. Maestro and Remco going to be passing together. This duo plays so well. A nice drop from Mystic Remco and Maestro. The passing plays. Look at the way that they weasel around the defense and get their point on the board. You can't defend that. Maestro to Mystic to Remco. Back to Maestro like as a defender, and I'm the last one back, who do I try to stop? Like, yeah. it's non-stop, like. Which is it very deep. It's a little bit farther off this card than he wanted, and that gives it back to Red Eye, who's taking shots. Dogu gets the block, oh, but nobody is there, and Chelsea's able to put it in. What a play from Red Eye. Dedu plays this up and backwards to Shaw Set, but as he's falling it down, it hits him in the back, and perfectly centers for Shaw Set. Intentional? Probably not, but beautiful nonetheless. And the lead goes over to Red Eye again. You're right around halftime. Only a simple flick up though, and Jacob will steal that one away. Sad Jacob moving up the field. Jacob with a touch forward to Fireburner. They're gonna finish it off and tie it up with 30 seconds left. G2 had the lead, they overcommit. We see over zero come up. Lucino is not able to get back in time. And the passing plays from Jacob to Fireburner again. 17, first point on the board. Crazy passes over to Cookser. Aerial game is strong with these guys right now. Marky slams that one in and makes it a two point game. The midfield passing plays, what flip side has always excelled at. They rarely miss these shots. Cookser over to Marky Duda. Just making it so hard to read. Uh, uh, you know, misdirection is a big part of top tier Rocket League. Trying to make them think crazy. The and reverse sweep the world champions. They drop that one on the back. What a nice Dormant. pass there from Torment. Darkfire keeps it in the box. Matt will shoot, but Lechino, oh, and what it's Darkfire over the top. This team play is incredible. Who are these people? <laughs> Torment with a gorgeous pass to Darkfire, then back up to Matt, who touches it down, and then Darkfire reaches it before defender. Oh. This is absolutely insane. That was an amazing right, play. This one around. Cooks are now, passes out to Greasy in the mid. Panda will send it above the goal. Diva drops it to Pashi, who's able to get it past Marky into nice. the goal. A great play by Pashi, and Bacchidesis is on the board. Just a good team play in general. Look at Panda get that one out to Diva, who gets that up to Pashi, and they finish that one off. Very, very good awareness from all three of them, knowing that they have to get speed to get this ball moving forward quick. Point though, a lot of times it is one of the, the third position is one of the easier rotational positions to kind of just fit a player into, and a nice shot oh. there by Lachinio, dropping it in, making it a two goal game. This air pass, we see Kronobi touching this up, Lucino off the wall, following through, getting the shot, rotating his car, making sure to keep the pace. Incredible plays, G2. This is the G2 we've been waiting to see all Mark season. From over zero to be patient on that, knowing a hard touch wasn't going to come up from Sad, and they will set themselves ahead. Now 2-0, NRG looking to get a play started up here. Jacob setting that one up nicely with a shot on net. What a setup coming out from Jacob. Sad Jr. sees his opportunity. Jacob notices his teammate is way up there. Gives him the shot. It's not even just a pass. It was like perfectly placed. Like, I'm going to give you time to turn around, go up, get the angle, and have power for the shot. Great placement pass from Jacob. And a great Maybe shot. gone for a wild angle. And I know he's capable of it, but it would have been a very slow touch, and he would have had to take his time getting there. So we got there faster Ooh, instead. Oh, oh, oh. The counter play coming through for Oh My Dog. Tying it up immediately. Off the ceiling a lot. Getting there just in time, bouncing that straight down, and Dogu, Final Panda didn't think anyone was going to react quickly to that. Now for Oh My Dogs, they hold on by a thread. They need game five so badly. Snasky passes to Doomsy, who puts it onto the backboard. Can Snasky get up for this one? Turbo misses, oh, and that might be it. Snasky gets it in, and that's the win for Reunited.
incredible amount of pressure. Just that soft underside coming up from Doobsy to set that one up and a miss off the backboard. So hard to get those Spider-Man touches and Dogu gets a miss. It's almost three minutes of overtime. Pass for sure. Good job from Mystic. Realizing that Maestro is ready for a shot. Sepidom. Dropping this one in dangerous place. Flarky tries to pinch it off and it goes in. That summit with the lead in game number two. No way he got that touch. Look at that off the backboard. Nice and double. Just puts his nose down to put that to the bottom side where he saw no defenders. Great shot placement. Plays it straight back up to Dogu. Puts it into the corner and ELMP will pass down to Snasky who keeps this one high. See if ELMP can play this one down to Doomsy who takes the oh, shot. The team play coming through for Reunited. Goodness, oh, look wow. at that. And I was literally about to say, you're either going to see a great contest come out or a great team play come out. That's what a team will have to do to separate the Bible's trying to do right now. As Chrome puts that up for Sid. Sid off the ceiling to Chrome. Chrome up to Gino, and Gino's going to put it in <laughs> right over Lachinio's head for the second goal. What is just a stunning display of passing capabilities. We get that accidental second touch from, from Hot Wheels Sid, but the pass from Chrome over to Gino. Safety, you ready for a shot from Hot Wheels Sid. Chrome is ready to intercept, but he loses that contest. Good passing plays. This could be a goal here if someone can put it in. What a passing play coming out from that's pretty neat to put one in in overtime and get themselves another Spent win. Pass from Squill, oh my beautiful. Goodness. Getting up and using the nose of his car to let it lightly tap down. Is waiting for a perfect pass. Subin able to take the easiest shot he's probably yeah, gonna get. Over in the corner, this one's bouncing right off the ceiling. Zero's gonna wait and read it off the bounce. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? What a play from Iby Power! What is this? Kronovi getting around the ball in a way I didn't even know was possible from his angle. And then, oh no! Did you not see that? Zero was all the way, he was that? in the air. Gets it around Skyline, keeping it in that corner. Maestro drops it towards the box, and here comes Mystic to finish it off, getting that lead for Northern Gaming. Signature pass off the backboard. Maestro putting that so far left from the angle. He actually came under up underneath that ball and Mystic following it through with an exceptional shot. An amazing play of it. That's a guy you want to start watching out for. Kronovi with a long shot up to over zero. The finish. What a passing play. Heads up from over zero. Drawing shots from over zero coming from above and these are not easy angles to make. We see the good clear from Kronovi and over zero getting just underneath nice. it. Rotating his car upside down to just continue its flow. Give it a little more power. Keep it with its speed. Carrying this one towards the corner, it's Maestro who puts it away. Mystic pops it over the top of one, and Maestro with another touch, winning all the 50-50s and gets the first point on the board. As you said, it wasn't even like Summit wasn't trying to, to make these 50-50s. They just lost every single one of them. Good call for Maestro to get that touch out from Mystic. Off the crossbar, there's no save. A critical play as nobody else was in the backfield. They played over to Elon Pugh, takes the shot. An excellent team play comes through again for Reunited, and they move up to two games in the Let's series. Let's go, and this is exactly the risky play that started it in the other end. Doomsie went up for that red the air dribble. Let's Nask gets a bump onto Kronovi, which buys some space for Turtle, who pops it high. Virginia is there. They keep this offensive going. A great setup by Overzeal. Can Kronovi finish in the top corner? Oh my goodness, what G2 a looking play great. play by G2. You see in this corner, Overzeal waiting, and the way that he positions his, his car on that wall, he's He's using that slight angle inside and just jumps. Because of the way that this map moves inside with that downward slope, he jumps perfectly into an angle and plays that top right. He might have even got that goal, but Kronovi not going to leave that open slam. A lot, and Dogu on the attack. Chance here. Good stop there by Northern Gaming as they move back the other way. The momentum. Oh, what a oh, shot. What a transition in momentum. The counterattack puts it in 30 seconds into overtime. Such a good touch by Mystic off that bounce. He plays it back against the wall to draw in Turbo <laughs> and around him. Break out and score. Mixer takes another shot. Chauset blocks this one, but it's right there in front of the box. Luckily, Tequila's got up into that one. Clear to the way, and here they come on the offense. They have 13 seconds to score. Red Eye needing a point to force overtime, but Marky with the amazing shot. shot, able to drop that one in. Marky Duda showing his mechanical skill, getting up just in time. That pop up for Greasy. Take a look at this. Rotating his car upside down to make sure he hits it with the top of his car, putting that around two red eye defenders who weren't able to get there quick enough. Gorgeous, gorgeous shot there from Mark. And it's what's buying them a lot of time to clear it. Nice play by Mystic, dropping it down. Remco will put it onto the backboard. Now Maestro over the top. What a pinch to add so much speed what? to the ball, and it goes in. What a play by Northern. I'm pretty sure Mystic just smacked Maestro to give him a little bit more pace on this ball. 
as soon as he hit it, <laughs> I can't honestly tell if he hit it and then Maestro hit it again. But either way, I mean, a, a little bit of a freakish accident was still would have been a decent shot by Maestro, forcing a defender to come out, but it worked out for him.